Resurrection has a way of shaking up our expectations. A celebration where we move from into a period of momentary chaos. It's a good chaos where things are shaken up, not quite what they seem, that lead to wonder and amazement at new life. That's the story of today's gospel in the Gospel of Luke on this Easter Sunday. It is one of my favorite gospel passages. The story where women go to the tomb three days after the horrific crucifixion of Jesus. It is the first day of the week, just before dawn, just before light is breaking through in the day. This story is so profound, it's told in the, all four Gospels. And some of the women are even named. You have to understand how profound this passage is because at the time of Jesus, women were considered property and really had no value as human beings. This good chaos shakes up that worldview where resurrection first is experienced by these women. Luke says, on that first day of the week before dawn, the women came to the tomb bringing the spices they had prepared. They were going to prepare the body. They found the stone rolled away. And they entered the tomb and did not find the body of Jesus. They were at a loss at what to think of this when two figures in dazzling garments appeared to them and stood beside them and said, Why do you search for the living among the dead? Jesus is not here. Christ has risen. And the two figures invited them to remember their experience of Jesus. And in that remembering, they led from this moment of chaos to amazement. And then they returned from the tomb to the 11 disciples and the others. And they told everything that happened to them. And here's the names. The women were Mary of Magdala, Joanna, and Mary, the mother of James, and other women. With them also told the apostles, but they, the apostles, did not believe the story that the women told. The story seemed like nonsense to the apostles, and they refused to believe them. Peter, however, got up and ran to the tomb, and he stooped down, but he could see nothing but the wrappings of Jesus. So he went away, full of amazement at what had occurred. This moment of resurrection in the gospel is this moment of chaos, disbelief, bewilderment, and amazement. Resurrection has a way of shaking us up. This week, let us pay attention to how we see God in our lives moving in ways that creates good chaos that leads us to further insights about ourselves and who we are in a new life. Where we, moments where we may think something is such nonsense It doesn't make any sense, but it leads us to think more deeply, to reflect more with our heart, where we come to believe. Let us pay attention and celebrate those in-breaking moments of resurrection, the good chaos that shifts and jolts our world towards something more profound and holy. This week, this day of our lives, and each day. Those are the moments of resurrection that we celebrate. Happy Easter, you all.